I am so much glad to be coming to you live this morning. In, in, and it is my pleasure to be coming to you live and it's going to be something that we'll be doing very often. Today being the first of its kind, I'm so much excited and I'm so much glad to meet you, my cherished audience. Um, I'll get to be explaining principles and theories behind the practical lessons. We'll as well be doing practical lessons in this live series where you get to ask questions, live questions, and I'll get to provide and it promises to be very educative, very informative, and we'll learn together, we'll share knowledge together. Let's jump into today's presentation. And so I want to turn to my slides. I'll be showing cameras, I'll be showing various gadgets that you'll be using in your CCTV camera installation. And so let's get to today's lesson. And um, let me turn to my first slide that we'll be using in our presentation. And so today we are going to be looking at CCTV camera installation. But the first lesson today is about introduction to CCTV. And so um, introduction to CCTV, in a nutshell, is a topic that is going to take you from beginner level when it comes to CCTV camera installation. And we'll build it up to an advanced level where we'll get to be able to fix any kind of CCTV camera at all that you find. And so I will um, quickly go ahead and um, go to my next slide so we get to see the lesson proper. Let's get to define CCTV. CCTV, as you may be aware already, is closed circuit television. Closed circuit television parts that I have listed on the screen. Every CCTV camera system will have cameras, will have recorders or a recorder as we go along and I'll be showing you each of these things. So it's not going to be just um, practice, it's not going to be just theory. We'll get to see all of these things one after the other. I'll be addressing them as well. I'll be addressing your comments and questions about this very presentation. Okay, so um, it's time to demonstrate to you what the cameras are, what they recorded so that I come to my table or my desk where I have cameras right here to show to you. So let's go. All right, so um, here is my table, that um, my table of cameras that, um, as I mentioned, a CCTV system comes with cameras, recorders, and display units. I have on the table right here various cameras, and I believe most of you would have already seen CCTV. As we move along, we'll look at why the different shapes and then the different connectors we'll get to see connectors on and all those stuff but basically these are cctv cameras which i believe everybody would have seen before this is the cam all cameras as you may already know now um let's also look at the next thing which are the video recorders you know um cctvs are not just supposed to capture images there is supposed to be a means where you'll be able to record your your videos and so to be able to record the videos that are captured there's the need to have the Who 
we must have a hard drive or a storage means on which your data will be stored. As we move along, we'll look at it into details. We'll look at the DVR into details where we'll look at where the data is stored. But basically, this is how it looks. The front does not have much. It is the back that has most of the activity or is the at the back that most of the activity happens so at the back of a, CC, a typical cctv recorder as i'm holding is to be able to coordinate all your components of your cctv camera system as i've mentioned there are three main components the recorder is one of the most vital components because it is what sits in the middle of all your cctv system all your, your cameras and then even the display units are all connected into the recorder through the ports that are at the back of the recorder. Don't worry, we'll look at what each of these ports stand for or what they do in the CCTV camera installation. All right, so we just mentioned that the CCTV system comprised of the cameras, the recorders, and then the display units. And so, how are all those units connected together? How are all the, the cameras, the, the cameras, the recorder, and then the the cameras, the recorder, and then all these display units or the display units that I'm talking about, how are they connected to connection that you can find when, you, when it comes to CCTV camera installation. There are three modes of connection that you can find. Um, the first mode of connection that we'll look at is um, using cables. There are some that you can find that also utilize what we call wireless connection and then also there are some that use the Wi-Fi connection. The most common that you find is what we call the cable connection systems where you need to lay physical cables between your C system that use Wi-Fi or you can just connect those cameras to your phone directly and you get to control the cameras from your phone. There are also those that come with uh, wireless totally wireless connection where there is no no uh, physical connection those cameras they come as a pair or they come as a unit a whole unit whereby there is no need to lay any cable you do not connect them to your phone either but there are wireless connections that are established that's about the mode of connection we'll be looking into details the the way each of them are connected but this is just to give you a brief idea of the modes of connection of your CCTV cameras to your CCTV recorders. And so that leads us to the next thing, which has to do with the technology and evolution. I call it technology and evolution. Technology and evolution because 